what is up everyone so I just thought I'd run through this because this boss I really struggled with it took me about seven hours to finally beat him and I'm just gonna share with you the little the little tricks I kind of learned along the way and hopefully it'll help someone out I watched a few videos myself to try and try and work out how to do this and there's a few little things I kind of picked up myself that they didn't touch upon which I hope may help someone else out so firstly the first thing you want to do is deal as much damage as possible in this part so basically he has three phases so the first phase is the only phase you can use your immobilize so I would use that now as much as you can in the first phase um, and try and use as many spells as you can now just to get as much damage done to him as possible. So I've gone for Cloud Step. I get a nice good hit on him and just build your focus. Just try and build that focus up because you want to be doing a lot of heavy attacks. So I've used my spirit now as well. Immobilize and I just want to build, build, build my focus. As soon as my focus is built, I'm going to do a heavy attack. I didn't actually there because I, I just missed the timing. So what he's going to do now, he turns gold no point even hitting him here now a few people have said you can break him out of his gold using heavy attacks through my experience you can't i've tried i've tried i've tried i've tried heavy attacks i've tried magic attacks i have tried everything nothing would break out of that gold for me now this is a little trick i learned that no one else noticed when this ring is around you, you cannot escape this ring a lot of people were trying to dodge side to side and they were still getting hit by the projectiles just don't move and use your staff spin that's all you have to do and I cannot stress enough practice your dodging dodge 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 in this first phase you really want to try and not take any damage at all you'll see in a moment why it does get harder obviously this this boss has three phases obviously each phase gets a little bit harder but you'll see why I tell you to save as much health as you can now as he goes into this phase this is basically him changing back from gold so you are able to hit him again. Do not go close to him in that phase because that will just wipe out all of your health and you will be dead. So just get as far to the corner as you can. Now it's just rinse and repeat. I use my immobilize because I'm still in the first phase. Build my focus. Dodge any attacks. And now it hits a cutscene. This is why I told you to save your health because this cutscene you can't escape it you have to go through this cutscene and during this cutscene you will lose some HP so if you can get to this cutscene without losing any health at all you are on good measure if you look now see I have lost some HP this attack I found the best way to dodge is to just try and stick to his side or even better behind him and then you just want to build your focus heavy attack build your focus heavy attack that's that's all I keep doing and then I move away and dodge. Turns gold again. Same, same principle. Circle is here. Just do your staff spin. You're not going to get hit. Nice and easy. So if, if you're looking now. I haven't actually taken any damage at all. The only damage I've taken is through the cutscene. Which I had to do. I have drunk my drink. The re-health. And then just dodge. They're, they're pretty easy. These are all easy dodges to, to make. But some of them do get tricky, as you'll see later on. Because I, I, this is the only time I've ever beaten this guy. And I nearly lost this right at the end. I, I done so well. And the last phase, I nearly blew it. The main thing with this is patience. You really need patience with this boss. There's a lot of waiting around. Don't just go in gun ho because you, you'll just get slaughtered. You cannot hit him like that. Here we go again, staff spin. You can't hit him when he's in gold and some of his attacks are just devastating you get caught in one of his combos and you're a dead man or a dead monkey so just be patient he's gonna do his his like bomb attack thing where he explodes again this is gonna change him back from gold run in i usually do a cloud step get a nice hit on him it stops him using his attack and then build my focus dodge heavy attack it's just rinse and repeat rinse and repeat but the biggest thing is to stay away from any attacks and dodge 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 you, you your dodges have got to be perfect like that for instance 
I still haven't taken any damage. Another thing to note is when he does a big, he does like a big attack and it rips up the the floor. It leaves a line in the floor of concrete of uh, like lightning that stays for a while. If you touch that at any point in the game, it will take HP off you. Now, as you can see, I've still not lost any HP, but we hit another cutscene now, which is moving into phase three. This takes off more HP again. So this is why I'm saying try not to use any HP. So I'm I'm healthing up straight away. This is the one I'm talking about. This leaves a nice line in the floor, and that will take your HP throughout the, the rest of the fight. So just stay away from that. I didn't dodge that one, unfortunately. This is what I mean. In the last phase, I nearly lost this battle, but stay away at this point. He doesn't change to gold in this phase, I don't believe. At least he didn't on this one. I can't remember. I've done so many attempts. But this attack is ferocious. You really need to have your dodging game on point for this. I did take slight damage here walking on that line. But that attack is like four or five swings. And it, it, that is hard to dodge. Um, I got killed so many times by that attack. It was unreal. I probably... I want to say I'd probably done 40 or 50 attempts. It took me seven hours to beat this guy. But it's the same principle. Just build your focus. Because... These little attacks aren't really doing a lot. You need your heavy attacks. This is what it is. You're just knocking his life down slowly but surely. And I missed my spirit there in bad timing because he disappeared and moved over there. But again, it's just dodge, dodge, dodge. The biggest thing with this is patience. You just need a lot of patience. But this is the biggest tip I'll give, give you. Some people jump out the circle and the projectiles are still coming at them. Some people try and dodge in the circle. Just don't move and use your staff spin so you will not lose any HP there at all to me this fight is all about patience and saving HP you, you, you'll always get your opportunities to hit him um, you just gotta be patient there's no point going guns blazing don't attempt to hit him when he's gold and just try and stay from his attacks he's doing his, like, his bomb phase again I tried to save my fire guide to the end which I did in previous previous attempts and you can actually do burn damage to him, so his health actually carries on decreasing as the fight goes. I messed it up there. To be fair, that this wasn't. There was some things on here which it wasn't my best, but this is the only time I ever beat him. But again, it is just building your focus, heavy attack. Get out of the way of his attacks. See that that line on the floor hit me again. Build your focus, build your focus, and he's disappeared. So that's the advice I'm going to give you obviously I know it, it, it goes without saying try not to take any damage but I can't stress the importance the first phase especially do not take any damage at all second phase if you can get through that without taking any damage please do like I just did but look how much I've lost now during the third the third phase a few s small mistakes on my part mine so that you could probably do a lot better but it's just dodge 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 build your heavy attacks that is the biggest advice I can give you and just save as much HP as possible like here I messed this up completely I almost thought I'd lost it now I'm so close and I thought oh my god I've lost this but just be patient dodge your attacks heavy attacks as much as you can you don't really need your magic the one the magic I used most was right at the beginning and that was my my immobilize because that's the only time you could use it and i just used cloud step throughout really as soon as he changed back where he was able to hit him i would just use cloud step to get a good hit and then start building my focus so i hope that's helped some of you out there any questions leave them in the comments and i will get back to you as best as i can but thank you all for watching and uh, please hit that subscribe button if you haven't already catch you all soon